welcome or welcome back. My name is Moth, and this week we are doing a another another challenge video because why wouldn't I? This week we are doing a 24 hour that says 23.59.59, but I had to start it to stop it so that I couldn't adjust it or anything like that. Um, but we are doing 24 hours of crochet, and we're going to see how much we can get done. Of course, that being said, I am going to finish one of my projects, and then after that, we will just see where it takes us. I have to get this project done by Tuesday. It is Saturday. And I only have a little bit left on it. I just, I have to power through and get it done. So once, uh, once I'm ready, I will start that. And then we will see after that what else I want to do. Because I don't know. But yeah. I'm going to get this ready. I'm going to get camera set up just right so you can watch me crochet and whatever. So give me just a second. Now it's it's 10:06 p.m. I have crocheted for a little over three hours. I finished 
my blanket. I'll show you uh, pictures of that when uh, it is dry tomorrow because I am now trying to block it in a way. Um, the little boy whose birthday that's for is on Tuesday, so I'll be giving that to them then. And then tomorrow I'm going to pick up where I left off or whatever with the, the mesh bag that I have like 65% of the way done. Oh crap, no, it's more like 50% of the way done. So that might actually wait until the end of uh, the challenge, just because I don't wanna. Um, I do have two tops to work on, so I might work on those, or I just might make more scrunchies. I really, the scrunchies were so cute. I ended up making another one, uh, another two of the blue and pink one, the watermelon, or the, um, I call it my blue raspberry one. Um, I made two more of those yesterday. One of them I was just testing with the eight millimeter hook, which is bigger by almost two and a half-ish millimeters than the one that I used for the actual video. So it came out very, very big, very oversized, more yarn, heavier, so I couldn't list it with the other listings and I uh, considered it a mess up and I gave it to my mom because she she bought the yarn so um yeah so I will see you in the morning I will update and then I will plan out my day good night <laughs>
Okay. We are... There's nine rows here and five rows here of this mesh bag. It's pretty cute. I'm loving how the colors are working out. So I am uh, going to keep going. We are down to 20 hours and one minute. And so I'm going to keep going. I'm just going to move over to my bed so I'm a little more comfortable and can actually watch TV. Because while my TV's right there, it's hard to, like, crane my neck up and watch it. And look down and do this. So, yeah. I'll be back. <laughs> It is Monday the 9th. It is 7.51 a.m. And I forgot to record last night. This is where we're at on the bag. I have the entire mesh part finished. I just have a couple, I think it's five rows total of the straps. Um, and I've got one row as of right now, obviously. I've got just the chain row. So I'm going to do five more rows of that, and we'll be done. This is where we're sitting for time. We have 17 hours and essentially 17 minutes left. Um, I want to try to get through as much of that today as possible, um, seeing as I'm home most of the day today. So Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays are my home days. Um, I mean, besides the weekends, but... I don't get a lot done on the weekend. Uh, so yeah, let's get started. I'm going to bring this downstairs uh, and I will be back up when it's done. All right, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay. Sorry, the coloring is odd again. It's my black shirt. It's fine. Um, there's that. We're, we got 15 hours left. I finished the bag. Ends are weaved in and everything. It looks really small, but I know it isn't. Um, it's got a decent amount of storage space. That's like the side view. This is the middle of the bag, just folded in half. Um, it took me all day, because it is now 1.37. I took a nap, I didn't feel good, so I took a nap. And then I had to drive my husband to work. And yeah, that's what I've gotten done today. But we have 15 hours, 6 minutes, and 39 seconds left. I'm going to go back downstairs and probably crochet up some washcloths. Sorry, I'm playing with my, my little scissors. Um, go downstairs and do that, and then I will update you when I can. Did you just start recording? Oh my god. We have 13 hours, 23 minutes, and 35 seconds left. And I finished my washcloth. It's got taco pie on it um but it's okay because it's gonna be for my mom and she already knows about it but i learned how to do the waffle stitch today so with the waffle stitch you can really just see the the stitches like that um it was a lot of fun to make it matches this bag same yarn I have only that much yarn left on this, which is about half, so, you know, it is what it is. I am going to get ready to start another project. I have to think about what I'm going to make, but we still have 13 hours, and I really just want to get this done as quick as possible, or get as much work in today as I can, because I haven't been able to get a lot done, so give me a minute. So, I can't figure out anything to make, 
So I'm going to double strand this yarn. It's a white and a blue. And I'm going to make a scarf, I guess, because... I don't know what else to make. And I have leftover of this blue. I've got three little cakes and then this white I've got a bunch of. So I'm just going to do that until... I don't know. I'll probably do double crochets and I'm using a... 6.5 yeah, 6.5 hook so we'll, uh, we'll get into it I promise Two seconds left. Um, I have gotten this much done on our scarf. I'm really liking this blue and white together. Very Christmassy. I almost want to turn it into a tablet sleeve, but it's not quite big enough across for that. Even if I added a couple rows for border, I don't think that it would be big enough. Because, like, it's almost it's like exactly the same size as the tablet so i don't know um but it'll probably just be a scarf but this is it up close it's very cute i like the way that the the blue and the white are swirling very um snowflake like but that's what i'm gonna call it for the night just because my hand is killing me uh, we went from, what, it was at 19 hours down to 12 or something like that, which means we've crocheted a lot today, especially since I finished off a whole bag in the last few hours, like, the last little bit. I finished off a washcloth, finished that 
um, blanket. I'm going to bring this with me tomorrow. Uh, Belle's got some physical therapy, so we're going to do that. And then, yeah, I'll update you when I get home tomorrow from our appointments in the morning. So, have a good night. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>
the song that I really forgot is just Belle woke up and he was very hungry and so we went downstairs and he spent most of the day downstairs. So, yeah. That's it for Thursday. See you tomorrow. <laughs>
Um, I've got quite a few sitting around, so we will uh, try to get as many of those done as possible. And yeah, this will be part of it because I've got just that part of that row and then the whole next row that's going to be yellow. And I used most of my skein. I have like just enough to say that I had that yarn, I guess. Um, I am making Belle a sweater, which is also in that same yarn, which is why I kind of want to save a little bit just to do another row of that color for each side of the sweater. So, yeah. Thank you for joining me. Make sure to subscribe if you like this content. Um, and make sure to check in next week when I do that. So, I will see you later. Bye.